Now, the Minnesota Department of Human Rights is encouraging communities to discuss disparities in education, especially when it comes to suspensions and expulsions. Reporter Meredith Hackler sat down with the superintendent at Brooklyn Center Community Schools to learn what they're doing to address the issue. Education is vital to a child's future, but for students of color, being suspended from their place of education happens more often to them than their white peers. When we look at our um, data and statistics, it shows us that predominantly, far and away, our um, African American students make up um, about 45 to 47 percent of our populations, dependent upon the, the school within the school district, and yet they account for upwards of 85 percent of both our classroom referrals as well as our out-of-school suspensions. The disparity isn't unique to Brooklyn Center schools. According to data from the Minnesota Department of Education, African American students were eight times more likely to be suspended in Minnesota than their white counterparts. It doesn't reform behavior. It doesn't change choices. All it does is provide permanent damage. Knowing the damage suspension and expulsion can cause to students, Brooklyn Center schools started changing their approach to discipline. There are behaviors that will occur that have to result in an out-of-school suspension, but we've dramatically reduced what those behaviors are and we work from the standpoint of really trying to bridge with families and to partner as opposed to exclude. And creating that change has helped decrease the disparity. In February when we looked at the data from February of last year we were down in classroom referrals by 500 and suspensions by 50, 60. It's just changing the philosophy and, and moving toward a growth mindset to really um, work on building kids up instead of pushing them out has been has been the big shift. The district knows the issue is still prevalent. We're very transparent about the fact that we have a long way to go. We have a lot of work to do in order to create an environment that is welcoming for all of our students, students of color, white students of all experiences, and we have to make that a priority. But they're working to create an environment that is suitable for students of every race and background. Every single one of our students deserves to be Respected as well. We need to see our kids, to see them show up in our space, to allow them to be their authentic self, and then that makes the entire community just that much stronger. In Brooklyn Center, Meredith Hackler, CCX News.